Hello, welcome back. Doing something a little different today. Playing this, uh, this delightful retro old school. Woo! Um, uh, what, what do you call one of these? I don't say platform, but I don't think it's really a platformer. Um, there's this flying spatula too, that's cool. So basically, it's kind of like Snake. That's the best way I can describe it. It's kind of like Snake, but it's not Snake because you don't grow bigger as you move. Also, I couldn't pull a spatula. What a shame, what a shame. So, uh, yeah, basically, you know, move around about, and you might be thinking, well, what in the world? Why is this on a Mind Touch channel? I don't care about some goofy 2D platformer esque retro looking kind of annoying music playing game. Uh, to which I would say, you are not alone, my fair friends. Ooh. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Catch Jason. Um. Yes, I would say you are not alone. I would, however, also say this is mind test related. Because. Wait for it, wait for it. Oh, that's funny. I thought the obstacle would. Oh, I died on that one. Wait for it, wait for it. This is actually running within mind test. Believe it or not. Oh, that was a moving thing. I shouldn't have hit it. Oops. Yeah, this is this is my test, my friends. This is uh, an unofficial port of Prang. I guess Prang is a uh, a real game like this. I've never heard of it myself personally, but oh yeah, oh yeah. Man, you can really get the points if you got the umbrella. Woo wee! Oh no! But look at that! Look at look at my skull! Look at my skull! It's so high! I'm like, I'm like, I'm super pro. Um, yeah, so, I suppose I should just, you know, there we go. Game over. Okay, swell. So we'll hit return. So check this out. Oh, I need to toggle this guy too. Yes, my friends. Yes, this is in fact actually playing within mind test. You can adjust the size of the game area by zooming in and out. Um, you can reset it, which that just resets it back in case somehow you, you screwed it up. You can toggle sky on and off, which obviously I just made it so big that you can't see the sky anyways. We have some instructions. This is Prang. I, I've never heard of this game, but I guess it's a real game. Collect food, obstacles avoid, get the umbrella to move fast, kill enemies. Um, yeah, we have John Barossa, Dave Alejandro, John Warosa. Rosa and Boros. Okay, interesting. Credible Loan. Interesting. Daniel Gary and Susan. Okay. Okay. Credits. Okay, so Secret Treehouse. The Calmer Day and Boink. Okay, coding. Game Geek 3. Okay, so this was originally a web game. Interesting enough. Game Concept Atomic Shrimp. Ka. Ka. And then, of course, we can exit. Now, this is this is where it gets fun. Because, yes, in fact, this is a mind test world. So you just create a world. Uh, you are, you have to use single node mapped in. That's the only thing available. So hopefully that name's not already been used. And we just go ahead and hit create. And then we hit play. Connects to the server. There you are. You can play praying in mind test. Um... Now, I don't know, I'm very curious, actually, what would happen if you ran this on a server? Like, if I was running this as a server, could other people join and play? I don't know, and in this video, we won't find out. But, um, yeah, there you go. You can play Prang in Mind Test. I, I can't call this a mod review because it's, it's technically a game, so I guess game review? I, I, that's it. So thanks for watching. Links are all on my website, which is linked down in the video description below. And uh, yeah, this is, uh, I, th I think I can honestly say this is the first of its kind. I have never seen anything even remotely similar to this done in my test before. So um, kudos.
kudos to Luke. This is, uh, yeah, it's quite interesting. It plays very well. Um, frames are jumping from like 30 up to 40-ish or so, which is weird because I'm getting 90 frames a second for mine test, so I don't really know what this frames a second means. I don't, I haven't looked at the code. I don't know if this is all done with Informer Specs. I have no idea how this is actually working. <laughs> all I know is it does. So if you want to download it, links are all down below. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.